Hey guys, welcome to my new video. In this video, I'm gonna show how to make this animation with using After Effects. Let's get started. So guys, welcome back and first of all, let's draw a character with shape layers. Let's create first background layer, solid layer and add the name background, change color to white, click OK, again click OK and lock layer. Then go to shape layers, hold this icon, select this ellipse tool and let's enable title action save and hold shift, make one shape layer like this. Okay, let's click session tool and change quality full and go to stroke width, change zero and fill, let's use yellow and click OK. Let's change name body. And let's go to window, enable align and click this icon and this icon for move the shape layer to center. Let's select this body, control D for duplicate and let's open inside contents, ellipse 1 and ellipse path 1, change size, go to fill, change color to white, click OK and change size more and let's put here. And select this body to change name I white. And select this ellipse one inside the I white. Let's control D ellipse one for duplicate. And let's move to right. Okay, and let's open inside the ellipse two. Open ellipse path one. Change size. Let's move to left a little bit. Okay, not bad. For move to anchor point center, hold control, double click, pen behind icon. Click session tool, go to align, click this icon for move to center these eyes. Okay, so select this eye white and we can change scale a little bit and put here. Okay, so in this time select this eye white, control D for duplicate, press S, change scale and go to fill, change color to black, click OK. Nice, and let's open I white to inside contents and select this ellipse 2. Let's move to right, select ellipse 1, move to left. Okay, that's good. And change name eyeball. <clears throat> select this I white, control D for duplicate, select eyeball, move to inside to I white layers, and click toggle switch mode, go to non. Select alpha matte I white 2. So select I white 2, link to I white, select I white, press S, click this icon, and right now we can make eye blink animation or we can move eyeball inside I white layers like this. So in this time, let's go to pen tool and make like this line session tool change stroke width and go to fill click none for for remove inside color click ok and let's see ok go to pen tool select this point move to right and move to center so right now I'm gonna change this smooth line let's go to pen tool and hold alt select this middle point make smooth Nice. Clicization tool, select shape layer, open inside, contents, shape 1, stroke 1, change bed cup to run cup. Select this shape layer 1, change name muff. Clicization tool, press S, change scale and move to center like this. Ok, let's go to pen tool and make eye bronze. Let's first make like this. Clicization tool, open inside, contents, shape 1, stroke 1, change bed cup to run cup and change stroke width. Ok. Select this shape 1 line, open path 1, select this path and go to pen tool, change path like this. Clicization tool and let's hold control, double click pen behind icon for move to anchor point center. Clicization tool and put here change name eyebrow left and let's control d for duplicate move to right and move to down 
and this is eyebrow right okay so let's create new new object for control all these elements hold control double click pen behind icon for move to anchor point center clearization tool and let's click this icon and this icon for move to center and select these eyebrow right left muff layer eyeball layer and eye white and let's one body link to null object select null object okay right now we can make your frames for animated so let's create hand layers go to shape layers hold this icon select this rounded rectangle tool let's make one rectangle like this clearization tool go to fill let's, let's use color yellow stroke change zero select pen behind move the anchor point down clearization tool and press r chain rotation and move to inside like this okay and let's open inside contents rectangle one rectangle path one change redness for smooth layer and also click this icon change size and this size okay that's good close change name hand left and let's control d change name hand right and move to right and right mouse go to here flip horizontal and change this 124 and move the inside body okay so select this hand right and left let's link to null object and select this null let's move to down make new person in keyframe go to 10 keyframes for shortcut you can use hold shift press page down in keyboard or let me show other way click time duration write plus 10 click ok and move to up go to 10 keyframes move to down and go to 6 keyframes click time duration write 6 click ok go to 3 keyframes plus 3 click ok and move to down ok let's see ok so select two frames make easies and go to graph editor let's zoom in here select this graph move to left and select middle two frame move to right for natural jump animation ok so we have problem with last three two frames back to two frames select last three two frames right mouse two frame interpolation change color settings to linear click ok let's see nice and select last few frames move to the left okay that's good select hand left and right let's press r and change rotations like this and this rotation and make rotation key frames go to first second and chain rotations to down and select two frames move to left select two two frames make easies let's see nice and go to next two frame change rotations like this and this rotation and go to here and go to 10 two frames again change rotation and this rotation again 10 two frames change like this let's see okay that's good select last few frames move to the left so in this time let's go to layer new and null object hold control double click and behind the icon for move to anchor point center clearization tool move to like this and let's select this null link to null one and null two change name face and select this i right i left muff layer and eyeball layers all these face elements link to face let's see okay this works and select this face let's go to here and press p make new person keyframe and let's move it down go to next keyframe change like this okay and go to next keyframe move it down and next keyframe change like this 
and go to here let's move to left and this keyframe move to center select keyframes make easies let's see nice very good and select is eyeball let's press p make new person keyframe and go to three keyframes one two three and let's move right okay let's see nice and go to here again create new passing two frame go to two two frames move to the left and go to here create new passing two frame go to two two frames move to the left and go to some two frames and create new passing two frame go to two two frames move to down and go to here Let's create new passing two frame. Go to two two frames. Select first two frame. Copy pass, and make two frames easy. Let's see. Select last eight two frames. Move right, and these two frames move to here, and this, and this. So select is I white, and go to here. Press S, and make scale two frame. Go to three two frames. One to three. Change scale five. Go to three two frames, one to three. Say first two frame, copy pass. Make two frames easiest. Let's select work area. Nice. Select this sketch two frames, copy and go to here, control V, and here, control V, and here, paste two frames, and here. Let's see again. Nice. And let's select these two frames, move to right. And these two frames move right for more slow animation and these two frames and less two frames this. Okay, let's say again. So let's select this sketch two frame, delete, and these two frames delete. Let's again let's preview. Nice. So we can select these two frames, move to the left, and these two frames move away for better timing. Also this I blink two frames. nice so select this face and go to here let's make new person two frame and go to 10 two frames and move to right go to middle move to down let's see nice and here make new two frame for face go to some two frames move to down let's see very nice and go to here and create new passing two frame go to 10 two frames move to left and go to middle move to down for smooth animation okay and here new two frame go to some two frames move to down and right now let's go to here and again create new passing two frame go 10 two frames and move to center so let's say animation okay very nice and select these eyebrow layers let's zoom in and press R open rotation and let's see timing okay right now make rotation two frame and go to here let's chain rotation like this and here make new rotations got some two frames and chain rotations let's make two frames easy select work area nice and here make new rotations again go to next few frames chain rotations okay and here make new rotations again Go to some two frames, chain rotations, and next two frame create new rotations. Go to last two frames, chain zero and this zero. Okay, very nice. So let's create new pan cards for left and right hands.
select these like tags, link to shape layer 1, select shape layer 1 and move to inside, press R, chain rotation and move the anchor point down, click tool and move to here and let's chain rotation like this. Okay, and select this shape layer 1, change name, card, left. And select this card left and like. Control D for duplicate, move to up and move to right. And let's double click for edit. Let's write here share. Clearization tool and select this card left, change name, card, right. And press R, chain rotation and put here chain rotation a little bit and this card press r chain rotation so in this same select this card left let's link to hand left select card right link to hand right let's see nice very good so in this same select this hand right and let's see, press R and make new rotation keyframe, go to 10 keyframes, chain rotation, go to 10 keyframes, again chain rotation, again 10 keyframes, change and again change. Let's go to 10 keyframes for loop animation and let's see. Nice and select this card right, press R and make new rotation keyframe go to 10 keyframes chain rotation like this go to 10 keyframes chain to left and again make more keyframes ok so select last keyframe, move to left and make keyframes easy let's see Nice, very good. Select this hand left, press R, and in this time make new rotation keyframe, go to 10 keyframes, chain rotation like this, go to 10 keyframes, change rotations for more keyframes. Okay. And select this card left, go to here, and Press R, open rotation, make rotation two frame, go to 10 two frames, chain rotation, go to 10 two frames, again change, again 10 two frames. Okay, so select two frames, make easy. Let's say animation. Nice, very good. So finally, let's add shadow, close these keyframe settings and go to shape layers, hold this icon, select this ellipse tool, make one ellipse like this and change stroke width 0, fill, let's use color dark like this, click OK, clearization tool and let's move to down, also move to behind all these layers. Okay, so we can move to down a little bit and in this time go to first second and press S, change scale 0, make scale 2 frame and go to here, change scale like this and next two frame change 100%. Make two frames easy. Let's see. Nice, select two frames, go to graph editor, select this graph, make graph like failing animation. Let's zoom in graph, select first two frame, move to left, nice, and close, title action save, let's see full animation. So guys, thank you for watching my video and don't forget to subscribe to the channel, like video and please follow me on Instagram. Good luck!